Good Finn Nation. What's good? It's your boy Reason, and we are back here for another one. I am joined by the homies, Mr. Ballgame, and the homie Martin. Um, boys, uh, trade deadline pass. No Deshaun Watson. We find ourselves sitting here breaking down um, to a tongue of Loa, all 22 against Buffalo. And it went from potentially being the last time we could have done it to we know we'll at least be doing it for the rest of the season. Um, how are you guys feeling? What are you guys thinking? Mm. Uh, I'm I'm st- I'm still excited, man. Um, uh, obviously, this is this is a a Tua's Day special Watson Wednesday edition. <laughs> yeah. Considering the you know the 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 circumstance of free agency yesterday. Um, but, but I'm, I'm as, as much as, as much as, um, you know, the talks were around, um, should we get Deshaun Watson? Are we going to trade for him? Is it going to happen? Um, for it to not to come to fruition, um, it's a double-edged sword because it's, it's a good thing because now we actually, you know, have, uh, a, a, a scenario where there is no, are we going to get him? It's no, we're not, not, not right now. And now, you know, let's see how this team responds collectively to, okay, this is the team that we're rolling with. This is what we're going to be doing moving forward. Let's play football. Um, but at the same time, it's still, it's still uh, that, like that, like I said, that double-edged sword negative, like, damn, bro, why even entertain it? You, you know what I mean? Why, why even, why, why even allow that type of, you know, energy to, to enter, you know, your, your, your locker room and your atmosphere and your daily routines? Because I, I think, I think we've, come, we've all come to the conclusion that the, the results of this season being one and seven, it could easily be a direct reflection of just the overall distraction that, that we had to, you know, endure with. Um, Deshaun Watson's potential of coming to the Miami Dolphins. So now that it's over, um, now that we're turning the next page for the next chapter, I mean, let's let's go ahead and and, and see how you know not only just Tua but the team responds and and see if we can reel off some wins, man. Because it's been a while, fellas. Week one was the last time we felt good after a game, man. You know, it's it's been a long time coming, man. Let let's see what happens. Where are you at, ball game? I'm not tripping one way or the other, man. Um, anybody that knows football knows that Deshaun Watson right now is a more polished um, product than Tua is. But um, all the stuff surrounding him for me made him, as I always say, like Chernobyl. So the fact that the Dolphins handled this as bad as they did, that's my only issue. But you know. Let me move on from that. I don't think Tua's a petty guy. I don't see the mm-hmm. point in um, holding um, holding a grudge either. You know what I mean? It is what it is. At the end of the day, the NFL is a business. Um, they say 90, 90% of the stuff wasn't a tr- was was untrue. We're waiting to see how that all plays out. But you know, as a as a whole, um, I'm just going with the notion that you know, what I'm saying Tua's our quarterback. He's gonna give him an opportunity to prove that. He's NFL worthy, and um, everybody will fall in love with him at some point. You know, I don't think the kid, by any stretch of the imagination, is going to go out and not compete. I think he's going to do exactly what um, he's been doing, trying to will this team to um, as many wins as possible. I think what people need to come to terms with also is the fact that this roster is really not as good as they thought it was. So he doesn't have a whole lot to work with. You know, now you know some people might disagree with me on that, but you know everybody's entitled to their opinion. But at the end of the day. If you can tell me what players we have on this team outside of X uh, and Gasicki, maybe in the other um, 23, hold up, 22 positions of the top 10 in their in respective positions, then I listen. But, you know, uh, Christian Wilkins took three years for him to get to where he is right now, being the number one guy against runs um, and run stops at the defensive end position slash DT for 3 4 slash 4 3 hybrid defense. But, it takes time, and this team's young. And I think, you know, overall, like I said, Flores just overestimated his ability to probably get this group 
um, past the, the amount of veteran experience that, that walked out the doors last year uh, in the offseason. So what we're seeing now is a direct reflection of that, I believe. And um, I'm going to throw this out there, too. Man, we're never going to really get to see the best of who two we really got to offer when you got a tight end coach, former tight end coach that's, you know, the guys are special as far as the intermediate areas of the field. Let's be clear about this. Mm-hmm. Teams, that have, teams that have offensive coordinators that have been quarterbacks, you know what I'm saying? You can see the vertical game. They see the field differently. Mm-hmm. This guy played the ball. They play, this guy played from, you know, he coached players that play from the line of scrimmage 15, 20 yards upfield, and that's it. Mm. So you're not going to have a whole bunch of complexity. So when people are talking about, oh, you ain't pushing the ball down the field, well, how are you supposed to push the ball down the field when you got double drags, a hitch, taper route to the running back, and a backside dig at 15, 13 to 15 yards. That's it. You know what I mean? So knock it off. Mm. Yeah. Um, let me ask you this. Everyone's trying to spin the hole. Well, he's got an eight, nine games to audition. Do you think if it even matters what he does from here on out with this regime? Nope. I, I, I concur. Set, I, think they've set their, I think they've set their sights clearly on trying to um, get Watson at this point. Um, mm. They're going to make the pitch just as much as there will be others, right? And they're going to bank on the fact that he said he only wants to come here, but there's going to be a lot of teams. If he clears this, if he if and when he clears this situation he's got going on, there's going to be a lot of teams competing for his services. And I just don't know. I mean, I don't know how they hold on or how the Dolphins hold them off. You feel I, me? I, like, I still I still see Tua using this not not as a as a as a rehearsal or as a tryout for the Dolphins to see if he's the guy moving forward. But this this is a very very unusual and stressful circumstance for a technically first year quarterback considering he's about to start his 14th game in 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 a regular season and and look I'm 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 just I'm just thinking to myself I think I I just believe two is going to I think two is going to take this opportunity to just really keep his head down grind and get better because you know I've like like you said, it, it's it's pretty much writings on the wall, bro. Like they 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 want to move on. Not not mm-hmm. that they should, but they've 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 they pointed all to. signs to want to. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right, guys, smash that like button. Um, subscribe if you're new here. If you'd like to donate, paypal.me forward slash finside. Also become a patreon, patreon.com forward slash finside the NFL. Also, you can join, become a YouTube member. You can hit that join button right next to the subscribe button down below. Smash that like button. Hit the notification bell so whenever I go live, you guys get notifications sent right to your YouTube page. Um, all right, let's hop right into this because uh, we got a long one today. Now, I will preface this. Guys, I updated my Mac this week to this new Monterey iOS and the reason why we were taking so long to start tonight was when I was bringing up the video, it was being laggy. So we decided we got to roll with it. I'm going to try and figure this out. Um, after we do, we do this show, but so maybe we can have it fixed for next week, but bear with us. I mean, just, just, just think of it as slow-mo at times. Um, all right, boys, you ready to get into this? Cause you know, Today was just mm-hmm. a, a, a today's been an absolute crap show. Like, I mean, I tried to send this to you guys, it got rejected, and like, it's just today's been one of those days. This that new software, bro. Weeks. No, this might be that new software. No, it was my uh, Gmail. I need I needed to clear up storage. It's uh, just been one of those weeks, man. So, <laughs> all right, let's uh get into Let this. Let it flow through. Let it flow through. All right. So you got two in the gun, Gaskin to his right, 11-man personnel, two receivers to the left, one to the right. You see Gusecki's motioning to the right. It's going to be a play action here. Tua's going to stop. He's dropping back. If you can already see the left tackle, Eichenberg, Eichenberg is getting beat bad. If you look at the right guard right now, Hunt, he's getting beat bad. Um, And Hunt is also going to give up on the play, so Tua's going to get hit. As he throws the football here, and that's Hunt's man right there that came in for that shot. 
Um, ugly first rep by Miami. Um, obviously, he was trying to hit Gaskin, who came out of the backfield on that out towards the sideline, but you'll see the rep here. It's just flat out ugly. Look at this. Mm. It flushes out, that, and then boom, this, gets rid of it. And, and I, I thought I was seeing things during the game, but the pocket was collapsing oh, damn yeah, near oh, immediately yeah, almost oh, all oh, game. A lot of immediate pressure, bro. Yeah. Mm -hmm. like they, yeah. they legitimately – it surprised me. This is what their honest. difference between their defense from last year That's to true. this year is. This is what people aren't understanding. Guys, they're the number one pass defense, and they're number six against the rush. This is what – they okay. They got a great linebacking core with Milano and Edmonds. Mm -hmm. They got a fantastic secondary and one of the best safety combos in the NFL. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. now you know they had Ed Oliver in the middle, but now with they've got guys in the pass rush to complement Mario Addison and Jerry Hughes and mm. Epinesa and Russo and, mm. and and it's all coming together. The pass rush is what has made the difference for them this year. Wow. That's what so the, the difference for this defense is. So this is the number one defense in the NFL, bar none. Yes, technically yeah. speaking, they are the number one. If you're going by statistical rankings, they're the number one defense in the NFL. Mm. Dude, did you – have you – like, okay, think about this for a sec. Have you have, – uh, other than when we played them, have you followed the Bills at all really this year or not really? I have, I have yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so have you – have you – did you see what they did to, um, you know – Patrick Mahomes? Yes. Patrick Mahomes struggled. Struggled bad, right? Like mm -hmm. 35, 33 of 54, 272, two touchdowns, but two interceptions. It, and, and stats aside, I'm talking about the look test. Oh, it looked like yeah. they were they were getting to that guy. And you see what they did lot. to Tannehill? He, yes. Same, Tannehill, same song and dance. Tannehill mm -hmm. technically put up, well, he had a worse completion percentage, but very similar numbers to Tua. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, we don't got to talk about Davis Mills because this is his first year. He threw four interceptions. Yeah. I mean, you saw what they did to Big Ben and Henneke, too. Yeah, yeah. Like, the defense mm -hmm. is actually good. They're not, and it's because they have a pass rush now. Right. That's what the problem is. And mm. as we're going to see here, a lot of the times, two was going underneath because there was good coverage downfield. The, like, you're going to see a lot as we get into this. They're gonna their pre snap to post snap look is gonna be very altered a lot of the time. Mm. Like they're moving a lot of pieces around. This is one of the more active pre snap to post snap defenses we faced all year. From what when, when I when I watched um when I watched you know all the dropbacks here when I was chopping it up. Well, well, coached very and well disguised. Yeah. yeah, they're very active, man. Mm. All right, Amen. so we got. Right now, Tua in the gun. Um, bunch left. Yeah, bunch left. Um, you know, one man personnel basically, um, because you only got a tight end up on that line to the right. Mm -hmm. You got receiver split wide right. Bills kind of show like a cover three cover cloud three, look. Five. Yeah, mm -hmm. um, and this is where Tua makes a big boy throw here, people. Uh, that whole shot to Devontae Parker along the right sideline in tight coverage with the safety crashing hard over the top. When you watch it here, like it is a thing of beauty. Right in the hole. Dropped Boom. it in. Parker ran that fade to the outside along the sideline, and Tua just dropped it in the bucket. Beautiful throw, beautiful catch. Mm -hmm. Watch it one more time here. Mm -hmm. I mean, this is a big boy throw. I don't know what else to tell people. He all began. Day, day, he, he began reading the field side, but then noticed per the coverage. You know what? I, I might like this one on one. I like one that one on here. one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Mm. I don't know, man. I like. I like. This is. These are the throws we want to see more consistently and often in a game. Right. I you agree. Know? And and, and not, not only just the type I don't of throws. Want to see but, in a 50 50 situation, though. You know what I mean? Like, come out. But you know what my problem is, ball game. We watch this drive. Parker and two are building something. Mm -hmm. mm. Why the, why the f did we get away from it once again? You see, here's my here. Okay, here's what's really tapping my ass about the scripted plays. Okay, guys, the scripted plays, those scripted drives, they're working. But what any good offensive coordinator, what any good coordinator or offensive mind at all, I mean, basic shit. When the scripted, listen. 
you do a scripted drive, right? A scripted drive because you think that's what's going to work and go down and get you seven, right? Right. Mm-hmm. When it shows you that it's going to get you points, you, you stay on to that formula. You mm-hmm. just add and take away things to give them different wrinkles and different looks mm-hmm. every other drive. But you keep the same basis formula, and we keep getting away from it. Like, every time. These scripted drives in the first half, second half, we score – then we, whether it's up tempo with some RPO wriggled in, then oh, we go all bullshit. of a sudden heavy RPO. Like, you know, we just get away from it. Like, we, we don't stick to the script that they've created that shows them in game. It'll work. Right. Mm. Because realistically, you know how to ball game, it's hard to make in quarter defensive adjustments. Yeah. Those adjustments, for the large part, get handled at halftime if they can make them. Facts. Okay. Because so. Get them on their heels with the, with the stuff that's showing you it works, and then come up with a new script in the second half and see if it works. Like, there's just there's a nothing, lack of yeah. creativity and just the lack of competence of even when they do things that work, not continuing to stick with it is freaking boggling. Because Gailey used to do it, but these guys came in the room and said, "Hey, there's two of us. Hold our beers." Mm. It, it's so frustrating. To watch, and then again, we're gonna see an uh, uh, an instance today of you're gonna have routes in in the same area. You know, routes. You know, the t- guys sitting that, at the top that are right of the on route top of each other that yeah. are con- they're congesting each other. Mm-hmm. You know, you know what you're gonna see later on, people. You know how Gaseki had that fumble. You remember it snapped. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Guess what? On that same drive, about three or four plays earlier, he almost got hit with the snap again earlier but none of us just i think noticed it but he almost got hit twice on one drive with the ball on a snap and there were silent counts you can see hunt patting reader you know yes. what it tells me they're not prepared. They they're not they, well coached they, yeah they didn't rep that crap enough in practice yeah man mm. Did you as, as far as far as the again, silent count yeah problems with mm. these young kids that need it but you only have a certain amount of padded live action practices through the season because of the CBA. Mm. Anyways, it's rough, man. I digress. Um, so again, you're gonna see it here. Um, it's just this is just a beautiful play, a beautiful throw, good pocket. You see Hunt gets getting pulled back on the bull rush, though. Good catch though, right there. So now um we're gonna go into eleven man personnel. Two wide receivers to the left, one split wide right, two in the gun. Gaskin to his left. Bill showing cover two, but they're going to switch to a cover one single high look at the snap, and Tua is going to sail it over the head of Parker on the slant right here. You see that shift? Yep. And he just sails it over the head on the slant there. Um, You know, you want to look at it back, um, you know, I know they're combinations the slant, outside the slant seam yeah. and flat. Waddle mm-hmm. is, you know, you got a man mirroring him. I think it's 27. Is that your David's white? So he's ready. He's crashing on him. But the ball's already in the air, right? So, you know, mm-hmm. for example, you see Gasicki here. Uh, sorry, uh, Shaheen. Sorry, my bad here. Right at about the 43. He doesn't even look at him. So you don't know if he's going to come into the middle of that field, right? And the ball's already in the air. So mm-hmm. He's quickly out because he loves that slant. Incomplete pass. Who was that Just player that was on the ground for the Dolphins right there? Uh, can I see them from this view? Or do I got Ma- maybe. Let, let's see. Let's see. Was in the offensive line. The okay. Yeah. Game? Yeah. It's Liam. It was Liam. Yeah, Liam Eichenberg. Yeah. Mm, cut block. He, he struggled, bro. Uh, this game. Yeah. Yeah. He's, he's not very good, bro. Yeah, like, he's been struggling. Bro. He's not very good, bro. Mm-hmm. Um. All right. So two in the gun. Gaskin to his right, 10-man personnel, two receivers stacked on each side. Bills, they're showing cover one man. Bills are going to send five, and Mario Addison right here. Look at free rusher. Wide open, yeah. Free rusher, and that's because Eichenberg worked inside out. He did it right, and Addison came free, but adjustments needed to be made in protection Mm pre-snap. Off the back of his foot, completion. Waddle gets some rare yak. And what else can you say? What a what a play by Tua, man! What a play by Tua. Off his back foot, bro. A guy came in there, scot free, just made a play. Yeah, got him right there. He is capable of all sorts. But I, but but the I I I still hate like there there's still a panic 
type of like it, it's a panic situation. You know, it, it's not a it's it's not something that that Tua kind Buddy, of the pre- day he can draw back and survey the field is the day yeah. I'll streak naked on Streamyard, bro. <laughs> <laughs> okay, give me a break. Like no, I, I know, I know, but but I'm, it's, you know it's no noticed? it's no indictment you know on Tua. Like? It's more so you know what, just you know what offense. really went off on my head when I watched this all twenty two. Mm-hmm. And I want you guys to keep in your mind as you watch this and think about all the sessions we've done so far. This team does not get to a yak, eh? Nope. Like, mm. like there is not – guys aren't getting – you know, guys aren't making catches in open space. Guys mm-hmm. don't have a ton of open space in front of them. Like, mm-hmm. like, you look at Herbert last year. Almost half of Herbert's passing yards came on after the catch. You know, mm-hmm. we, we, you know, and we've got guys that can, that are speedy and can do it. We're just not designing and conceptually mm. getting them in p- the position to do it. That's this is, this true. is one of the, I'm just watching. I have not seen the stats. I'm going to look into them. I think we might be one of the worst yak teams in the NFL. I would not be surprised because I watched it today. And then I thought back to all the sessions we've done. I'm like, man, they really don't get yak a lot. Do they? And no. You know what I mean? And look at that. We're, we're kind of oogling over Waddle getting five yards and making a man miss because it's so rare that we get yak, right? So now when you actually got that in your mind, now when you watch, have that in the back of your mind when you watch these completions. Yeah. Um, two in the gut, 11 nowhere. man personnel. Gaskin to his left. Two receivers stacked to the left. Parker split to the right. Wilson's going to motion, play action. Two is going to pump right there to Wilson in the flats. And then he's gonna make a freaking laser beam throw <laughs> right laser here beam. to Parker on the top of his Parker. hitch route. Oh my god, bro! You're telling? I thought he had no zip, guys. Ah oh, man, he got it. He got it. That right in there, bro. Man. Right there. More, oh oh my goodness, that's more zip than a ziplock by Glade. <laughs> Look at that, bro. <laughs> that Come that on. was that was an impressive that throw, bro. Is a very Big, look! Look at where I frozen it right now. You have the linebacker Milano sitting underneath the hitch. You got Edmonds moving mm-hmm. to that side right now, and you got a corner to the left on top of Wilson in the flats. And two is like, "Eh, I got this." That is an impressive for, throw, ladies and gentlemen. For what for two to squeeze that in there like that, bro. Whew. That that was that was that that's beyond impressive. Oof. That is that is arm strength right there. That, that's that's threading the needle, bro. God, uh, what a throw, man! All right, mm-hmm. two in the gun, eleven man personnel. Gaskin to his left, two receivers stacked to the left. Parker split wide right again. So very man similar free. formation. Yep, um, from the Bills. Um, you know, but they're showing that the house might come a little too. Um, mm-hmm. so we're gonna do play action here, and I'm gonna freeze it. And you take a look, everything downfield is, is pretty well mirrored and covered. You know, mm-hmm. you got Gusecki, but you got the safety coming over top of Gusecki crashing towards him. Mm-hmm. So he's going to just throw it over the head of Waddle, throw it out of bounds. There's nothing there. Uh, um, I appreciate that throw. Yeah, the reason the red why zone. you see, mm-hmm. yeah, but what, the reason why you're seeing it here is watch C21 right here. C21. Point. Poyer, Poyer? Mm-hmm. Jordan Poyer. Watch what Jordan Poyer doing. This is why he throws that. Because the passing lane is full. He's coming in hard. He's like, I got to get rid of it. Mm-hmm. So he throws it away. He... Go ahead, Bogan. No, no, no. I was saying, I mean, he, he's doing a really good job of recognizing where the, where the, uh, the hot defender is coming from. Exactly. Yeah. Not and this, is, and this, is, and this is similar to, remember when he threw that pick against J.C. Jackson last year? Yes. Similar circumstance right here. Gets the ball away. Boom. I can't hate on it. I can't mm-hmm. hate on it. Get the ball away You're in the red zone, like Martin said. You know, protect the football, mm-hmm. especially considering what happened with that throw last week, right? Mm-hmm. So, mm-hmm. this is a bad miss by Tua, guys. You got 11-man personnel, two in the gun, gassing to his right. Gasicki's going to motion out of that bunch. Um... From on the left side to the right side, and he's revealing it's a cover one man look. Mm-hmm. You see Hyde moving with him right there. Guys, Shaheen is going to come wide open with nothing that's based on the drag route, 
and two instead is going to target Waddle. Coming, see Waddle coming across the middle right here. Um, Waddle on the drag for a short completion in traffic, but you see, watch so Shaheen. See, they're crossing on the drag, right? It's like a mesh concept, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. So now look at look at Shaheen got his arms up, boys. And wow. look at and look and at the defenders. And look at yo, bro. Andy, does he? Do you even need the blocker ball game? Look at the back. The the only the back is turned. Sees you. Yeah. yeah, the corner's back is turned. Look at the space, mm -hmm. Shaheen. Like, give me the ball. Mm -hmm. Throw me a vaccination football. <laughs> and he takes the short completion, but that is a big miss by Tua right there. It, it was, and, and and was the pocket was the pocket crumbling on him for him to uh, just say, "Let me okay. get it out of my hand." So, um, Eichenberg, Berg, and Davis are both bull rush, but I'm going to show you the God view right here. There's mm -hmm. room for Tua to feel that and shift up in the pocket to the left. Watch right here. Yes. So Eichenberg and Davis, 74 and 77. They're going to get bull rush, push back right now. Okay, right there, you got to step okay, up. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. You got to yeah, step yeah. up Absolutely. right there. And then, but he doesn't. He just, he's hopping around at the top of his drop step. And look at Shaheen's arms already going up. He can't even make that look over to Shaheen right now because Eichenberg's bull rush in his face. You got to step up. And he takes that. And again, in traffic, tight coverage, good throw, but there was a better throw there for you. Yeah. And and and, he, and it, even if you go back to that to that guy view one more time. Yeah, um Gesicki, that that would have been a, like a, a a first window throw for Gesicki as soon as he steps in. Get plant his right foot there. down and then make that throw right, right there, there. Yeah. past Milano but the problem underneath. Is Edmonds. I think the it, problem well, he has here is Edmonds. Well well that that's that's what I mean by a first window throw. Yeah. He yeah. cannot wait for Gesicki to cross yeah. over. over. Literally, as soon them. as he sticks, yeah. he sticks his foot in the ground, he just he just lets it go right there. Almost like how he split with that throw to DVP earlier on this drive. You just have to throw it right past that linebacker's ear and give him that opportunity. Uh, unless he felt that linebacker coming over, that's when he flips his hips and gets to Shaheen oh, on the uh, on the opposite end. Davis steps onto his foot here. Watch, there it is. Look. Yeah, bro, this 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 line this line is embarrassingly weak. If you guys didn't know, um, between Davis and Eichenberg, I don't know if you guys saw my show this morning, but they allowed 14 pressures between the two of them. Yeah, but Austin Jackson wasn't a part of it. Yeah, for the first time ever, <laughs> Austin Jackson did not allow a pressure. Yeah, it's embarrassing, bro. Um, okay, so. You got two in the gun with Gaskin to his left. Ten-man personnel, two-by-two two receiver alignment here. Mm. Um, Bills are going to switch the coverage at the snap into a cover-one man look um, right here. There it is. Right there. Mm. They drop him back. Um, Dang. It's like they knew action. that play was coming. Oh, Sorry? yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Play action. Um, Tua, again, is going to make a tight window throw on the slant and a completion to Parker right there. Um, mm. they knew what was coming for them. If you notice yeah. what they were doing was, um, okay. So they knew how successful we obviously were with the slant, right? Like that was no, I mean, they've watched the tape. We've all watched the tape. Right. You know what I mean? So, um, you know, they ha would have the CB, the corners sit on the slants and then they'd continuously blitz on third down. Um, and what's crazy is if you watch, especially early on, their pass breakups, the corners don't have to move very far because they're sitting in the right areas. They mm. they had our they had our offense pretty well scouted and the on and the designs and concepts. Like when your corners don't have to travel and they're getting pass breakups, we have issues. They don't get well, we mm. don't give people we don't give people much to have to No. To, yeah. This is your problem with going so RPO heavy. All right, um, you got you to gotta switch that up. You know, I thought we'd see that stuff we saw in the preseason where it was, even when Tua was in, it was like progression-based with RPO sprinkled in, and now they've gone RPO with progression-based sprinkled in. Um, so now right here we got 10-man personnel. Um, Waddle. Oh, sorry. Hold on, my bad. I apologize here. Um... Yeah, sorry, 10-man personnel, 2-by-2 two two alignment. Yeah, they switched to that, um, cover them one look, play action. Look at this throw, right between the defenders, boys. 
He's starting Split. to hit. He's starting to hit into that triangle coverage, mm -hmm. and boom! Look at they run into each other. Yeah, yeah. And, mm -hmm. and two of eight to completion. You gotta love it, man. Great completion by Tua Tungvaloa. It, it it once if Tua starts trusting these windows, bro, and I'm talking like at level two, level three, and just lets it go, bro. That I, I, I'm I think that's when real yak is gonna start happening, bro. What once he gets comfortable trusting these windows before they before the throw even you know leaves his hand, he's just he's just guiding it in there, bro. You know what I want you to I watch love here, this. boys? Watch 74 now from the God view, okay? Mm -hmm. Jerry Hughes. All right. I believe yeah, it's Jerry Hughes that's gonna come out and watch this. Watch this. <laughs> like he did like Jerry Hughes, if he wanted to, could have just gone right around him. Yeah. Like, look at watch, watch, watch Eichenberg. Because Eichenberg's not quick enough. Watch. Just give him a little touch. Look at how quickly he's around him. But he did, but why like, is his feet like that? Uh, then sand, bro. Quick sand. It's like he's wearing cloggers or something, man. Yeah. Like, what the hell? Nah, that's not. And then not you got look you... at Jesse Davis muscled through. So Gaskin doesn't even help on the chip block. But if it was anything longer, Davis's side was going to be an, an issue, too. We we haven't fired any coaches this week, right? No. Mm -hmm. Wow. How Lemuel Jean Pierre has a job is beyond me. Wow. Will Fuller must have taught him how to rob the team blind. <laughs> uh, ten man personnel. Um, Waddle's gonna motion right there from the left out of the trips bunch and putting the Dolphins into a two by two alignment. Laird is to his left in the gun. Tua is going to have a shot at Gesicki down here. He's going to come over the middle on the post, and he's going to have Ford underneath, but he's going to take Waddle on the out and good coverage. And again, this is one of those plays I'm talking about. Watch, they just sit on Waddle, and look, they just break it up. Mm. They knew that quick out was coming. It kind, it kind of felt, Tua had kind a good felt like a zone. It kind of felt like a zone coverage, but you can clearly see the man – almost like a soft man. And if that's the case, bro, I'm, I'm kind of working the other side. Now watch Gasicki. Look at Gasicki wide open. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. looking, And it's a good pocket. And look at Hughes backed off Ford. So Ford, you got Ford underneath too. Yeah. You got to take that post route. But he's I not love. even looking to that side, mm -hmm. my friend. You know what I mean? He, he's yeah. just locked in on Waddle there. You got to. You gotta, he had a, he had a, to, he had a, you gotta move your eyes. He had to dig under, um, right, right in the middle of the field. Let's see how the pocket looks. Clean throw. Oh, you got yeah. You yeah. gotta throw that to him. Yeah, you gotta throw that to him. And he's not even looking. Shish. And he takes the harder throw. Yeah. Inside the numbers. Yeah. And the and with the corner just mirroring the route. So, yeah, another miss by Tua. Mm -hmm. Yes. I'm telling you, the practices probably just walk through, bro. Oh, yeah, no, mm. way. no way. Um, what did you think of that? That was like that's an easy breakup ball game. Yeah, well, I mean, we haven't done anything that would that would force anyone truly to actually take this offense serious. So, in those instances where when you look at even formationally, we come out in the same stuff. It makes it that much easier for the defense, for the defense, just to say, you know what, we can stay home. Hey, we ain't got to, we ain't got to travel. We ain't got to do all this extra stuff. You make that ten times easier on the defense, and yeah. you know, mm. it, there's just no creativity, zero. Yeah, mm. I agree. All right, um, now um, two in the gun, empty set, Trey Wright, Martin. <laughs> um, two receivers stacked to the left. Okay, this is actually a really good job by Tua. So if I'm correct here, I think post snap they're gonna drop into like a cover four look, and Tua is gonna ID Travis White backing off Waddle, who's coming underneath on the out route, mm -hmm. and Tua is gonna make the throw for the completion. And you guys are gonna see a flag, and that's on Butler, the defense for legal hands in the face. Mm -hmm. But watch, see, look at White starting to back up, right? Come backs forward. off him, and mm -hmm. then he just takes the underneath. So that's a good recognition. He sees everything is backing, starting to back up. 
right? Mm -hmm. And they're, they're just going to sit on that long stuff to develop. And, you know, you only have one underneath route if you think about it here. Now, the yeah. pocket's pretty good. Eichenberg's getting beat a little. And Tua doesn't have a ton of room to step up. But the coverage is good. He makes the right read, makes the right throw. Good recognition, I think, there by Tua. I'm going to give him props for IDing that. Mm -hmm. I don't know what your thoughts are, Martin. No, I'm 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 right with you. I'm right with you. you look at look at pre snap. You're noticing that okay, he's creeping back. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And he you should, cover you see four. him. He saw his head move from the right to the left there, so he's working through, and mm -hmm. he makes it's a good throw. Yeah, good good read, good throw. A a everything was just perfectly, you know, re that that was a perfect re reaction to what he saw defensively. He got the ball out of his hands, and the pocket was clearly. What it was, he had to get the ball gotta, out. So we gotta commend Buffalo for doing their homework. I mean, they didn't have to do much, but you I mean, know what the problem is, ball game. The team yeah. continues to get pressure with us. This should show how bad our line is. Yeah, we we continuously get pressure just sending three or four. Yep, that's scary. Like that's that is scary, not bro. good, man. Like you saw earlier when um uh when was it was it Hughes or Addison was a free rusher that was the one time so far in the first 10 plays where they decided to, to send five mm. and they got a free man yeah but look at this four again and look at the pressure and so he gets it out good job you know and then we sit back especially in the fourth quarter boys i know the offensive line for the bills was having issues with us but i don't know if you noticed but when it mattered in the fourth quarter and in the third the offensive line of the bills started giving allen a ton of time oh yeah i, I it like their line that, got better as the game went on bro if if you were to and we like sent I, less people at him too man if if you were to do a split screen did you notice of what that what had to work with that. yes i know you noticed that yeah, he was just. I remember in the fourth quarter, him just sitting at the back of his, at the top of his drop step, and just, and just like, patting looking. the football, yeah, just patting, patting the football, football like who, who's, who's there, who's the there, who's there. I wish. It, and you know what the thing is, boys? How hmm. many Pro Bowlers do they have on their offensive line? Maybe one. <laughs> That's Maybe. good coaching. Mm hmm. Oh. Mm hmm. Frustrates the hell out of me, boys. I, I'm with you. I'm right with you, bro. This is unbelievable stuff. Um, all right, 11-man personnel, two receivers stacked to the right, Waddle to the left, two in the gun, Ahmed to his right. Bills are going to drop back into a cover three post-snap. Yep. And it's Zone. an RPO, right? And Get it to him. Parker Get it wide to open him. on that slam. Got it. <laughs> Some yak. Some yak. Got it. Big gain. Um, good play. Uh, good RPO. Right play. read, right throw. Yeah. Yeah. Right, read, right, bam. That so 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 the timing that he used to throw that ball to Parker, he has to start trusting that timing with Gasicki, bro, because Gasicki eats in that middle, bro. You know what the difference is though? Mm -hmm. Parker was out at perform a ton. Gasicki, from what Nick told me, only mm -hmm. out yep, once yep, or twice. yep, yep. You're right. Did didn't build the chemistry early. Yeah. Yep. Plus the route, the route, the route run is different too, though. Look how good their chemistry right. is right More now precise. without that work. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Parker's a fantastic route runner. He's that's what he's gotten better at over the years. That's true. He gets open, bro. Yeah, remember, like that's how he beat Gilmore so bad was breaking run. off his route so crisp and good timing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good timing. Good throw by Tua Tungvaloa here on that slant that this offense. Look at that. Ah, uh, like. Open it right. up. Uh, ten man personnel, two in the gun. Ackman to his right, trips right. Gasecki split out wide left. Cover two is going to be shown by the Bills. Empty. Two is, two is going to fake Waddle. Quarters. He's going to fake Waddle yeah. on that. Oh, sorry, I got the wrong. I got the wrong one here. Oh yeah, yeah, I got the wrong one. My bad. Mm. I got definitely the wrong play here. Let me read yeah. that. Gaskin motions out of the backfield to the left side. The Dolphins are in an empty set. Eichenberg is going to be beat badly by Jerry Hughes. Two is going to try to step up, but Hughes is going to get him from behind when he's sacked. Yeah, and it was quarters. Look at the, how they drop back their coverage, mm -hmm. right? 
Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. Tua just can't do anything. The next play is what the cover two is. Yeah. And you see the you see that it's it could have been a low high to the right, you know. Yeah, but look at this. Look, at look at how easily I can break up people. That's crazy. <laughs> look at this. That's crazy, bro. Look at that. But he wasn't even out of his kick slide and it was beat. Look at that. Wow. Nice. He didn't even get into his kick slide. <sighs> look. Look. Okay. Oh, look, okay. Look, look, uh, look. look. The, oh, the only. Slide and he, look at He's not even in. <laughs> <laughs> the what? only excuse is that it's a silent count, but regardless, you got you know your you know your center's voice more than the, the defender knows it, bro. You that's, can't you that's can't the sheer be that. Lack of tackle. I mean, that's yeah. the sheer lack of coaching right there, bro. That's like, terrible, man. And that's bad. That's that's oh, bad. you know that's a bad play by a kid. Yeah, and you're seeing right there, he does not have the he's not fleet of foot. He right, does not have the arms to hold you off till he can square you up. Look at right. how short his arm looks right there. If you actually think about it, right. So then, anyways, Jerry he just Hughes, got beat right off the snap, right around him. That was Addison. Yeah. Oh, sorry, Addison. My bad. I apologize. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, and yeah, because right off the five. snap, bro, it yeah, was old. like brutal. Jeez, uh, One more time for everyone there. Ugly, ugly rep. Go succeed, though, boys. You're right. <laughs> I was just in the, I was in the back of my mind, but it's cool, bro. It's all two. Don't though. you got to throw it? Don't you know two got to throw his own blocks before he makes the passes, bro? <laughs> Jesus. So, but but the, okay. So, a, a real quick reason. Yeah, go ahead. Do you want me to bring uh, it back? Well, not not necessarily, but just just to mention, pe- people are even trying to go to the extent to say, well, well, he has to be more athletic and and. And, and evade that pressure in it. It's like, bro, can you stop and just say the oh, offensive yes. tackle completely missed his block and Tua had no time to read and make a throw? Can you just say that instead of saying, well, Tua should be more, more of an athlete? And like, no, he's a quarterback. His job is to be in the pocket and make throws. He did not have a pocket right there. Right. That that was it. Case closed. And he tried to step up, but – what are you gonna do? Yeah, nah, man. I mean, Berg is Pupua, bro. I'm telling you, I would have rather taken my boy Tevin Jenkins. Yeah, gone without the without him for the year at this rate. Are you kidding man. me, bro? Man. Oh, and it gets worse. Okay, so ten man personnel. Um, two in the gun. Akman to his right, trips right. Gaseki split out left. This is the cover two. It's gonna be shown by the Bills here. Two is gonna fake Waddle down here at the bottom of your screen. Waddle is gonna fake him on that bubble screen. Um, and I think he's going to want Gaskin, who's going to leak out into the left flats, but the pressure gets there. Look at that. Did you see how quickly Ed Oliver was there? Mm. Look at that. The ball was snapped. Ed Oliver was there, boys. Watch. Let's count. Mississippi's ready. One Mississippi. Two. Two. Oh. And we're going to watch it from the God view here. I think he was. So you see, you wanted Gaskin, who was leaking out into the flats there. Watch this. And look at Hunt. Okay, that's key. Watch this. Watch Hunt at the end here. It actually... Look at Hunt. Put his hands on his face right there. You see that? That means that was supposed to be a slip screen. Yeah, watch, watch, watch. Watch, everyone, watch Hunt at the 43 after the play. Oh, mm. he's, just, he's just letting everybody know he fucked up. And look, yeah, yep. right? Like, he's like, oh, yep. man, I messed up. Right? Okay, watch. Here you go. Just lets him through. And what's crazy is he has his hand out. And there's no one else. No one right. up over Austin Reader. <laughs> there's no one heads up over Austin Reader right now. Oh, man. What are you doing? Come on, fellas. It's the little things, man. It's what lack- are you doing? It's the lack of coaching And look at he me. put his hands on his face. Look at that. It's the little thing. That, you know but- why? Because Ugh. he's learning a new position and coaching is even more important, and he's not getting it. And this, 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 this that that should highlight how young this offensive line truly is, bro. You stop in the middle of the play and just put your hands on your arm and like, <laughs> I messed up. Oh my god! They're, they're so young, bro. They're so young. Two man. plays in a row, to a we can't even count to two Mississippi. 
<laughs> two, two just threw that like, man, for <laughs> this, bro. Yo, the yo, let me get out of here, bro. Get out of here. Yo, I got rid of it, bro. I got rid of it, bro. Get off me. <laughs> Unreal, man. So uh... now we got two in the gun. Empty set with Gaskin motioning out to the right. Bill's going to show cover two again. Um, Tua is going to take Gaskin underneath on that drag for a nice completion as Gaskin is going to gain. Look at Yak. Oh, my God. What is this? What a rarity. Oh, and everything was covered downfield. Now, mm -hmm. I'm going to show everyone everything was covered downfield. for. That was man free robber. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And watch everyone, everything downfield. Like that's all that's that's mm -hmm. that's covered. Yeah. Okay. Um, so he takes a smart read, takes the right read. Maybe okay, but here's the thing. Maybe very, he takes very... that shot with four. No, you're uh, you're crazy. That one over the middle you're talking about? No, 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 oh, no. Right. To to the left sideline. To the left sideline oh, right there yeah, at the yeah, 50. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm not nah, that's covered. That's covered. Yeah, I'm not taking that. No. Maybe I got wide but... open underneath. Near yeah, the, yeah, a couple yeah, yards in front yeah, of the sticks. I'm taking. The yeah, game. give give it the gas. Give it the gas. Okay. Man. Does anyone notice a dolphin on the ground right now? Yeah, who is that? What's it like? That to? would be the esteemed Jesse Davis. Let's watch it from the God view. Ah <laughs> mm. <laughs> oh, man, if it ain't Jackson or it ain't Eichenberg, you can't make this shit up, bro. It's got to be <laughs> Jesse Davis. Uh, all right, so. Jesse Davis is a train wreck. Watch Russo. I agree. Russo is going to die for Tua's lower body, and it's actually da potentially dangerous. Watch. Just right around him, and then look at diving Oh, right there. wow. That is dangerous. Yeah, yeah. And Tua oh, just wow. gets rid of it. Bro, Jesse Davis is a hazard to Tua's health, bro. Like, I... If I'm... If I'm... The repeat... Uh, G, what's, what's the... What's the offensive line? Coach name Lemieux uh, Jean Pierre Lemieux. If I'm him, bro, I'm pleading to Coach Flores. Look, man, I know you like Jesse, but he's gonna get your quarterback killed, bro. Nah, look, look, you, look, 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 you, look, at, look at his posture. Look at his posture. Ball game. He's like, you, no. Listen, if you if you if you look whatever Pierre, he got to go too. Shit. Yeah, he does. I, I so does Grizzard, our uh, wide receiver coach, and our I think so. Team. Yeah, he he does he doesn't know what he's doing either, man. This is terrible block, terrible block, and that give me the chills, bro. Awful. As far as what this kid got to work with, bro. God awful, bro. And that's your blind side. Yup. Mm. All right. Um, two in the gun. Ahmed to his right, eleven man personnel. Two receivers stacked to the right. One receiver split wide left. Um, it was like a cover four look by the Bills. It's going to be play action. Tua is going to test near the chains, but he's going to overthrow Waddle here up mm -hmm. by the 15, by the 18 on the out route. But look at what he's got underneath leaking out to the flats on both sides. Shaheen is wide open. He had engaged and then released into the right flats mm -hmm. and Ahmed into the left flats. And mm -hmm. again, now it's Austin Jackson. He decided to let um, Latu Lele up the middle. Star. So, yeah, Star is a star, buddy, when he plays mm -hmm. us at least. Watch star. watch Star right here. Right up the middle on Jackson. He's shading Jackson's inside shoulder and mm -hmm. Reader's uh, outside shoulder. And he's going to just push. Look at it. He just get, chalked him to the side. Right. He goes right up the middle. I I, I respect the throw by Tua. He, he, his, his back is against the goal line. Yeah. Uh, the pressure's already cooking. Like, he's like, nah, let me just... Let me try to make a throw to to my to my guy. But he got look at Shaheen. You can already see him releasing right there over 24. Yeah. But but Super again. Um uh, but um the flats is where he should have went. He would have had it under the flats. If you go back to the flats, mm -hmm. he because like you see who's that Ahmed or Ahmed is in the flats uh -huh. right here. And mm -hmm. if you look into the other flats, look at you got Smythe. The flats are where I'd go with that ball. Okay. I'm just taking and, the I'm yeah. taking the yardage and getting myself away from the um from okay. the, true true from the, from the end zone. That's what I'm. Yes, doing. true. That's you know. okay. You can be checked down, Charlie, when you're right backed here. up like this all you want. Mm -hmm. I'm fine with mm -hmm. that. 
I'm with you. But again, Austin Jackson just ugh. abysmal. Yeah. All right. So now we got the Dolphins in 11 man personnel. Two receivers split to the right. Um, Gasicki to the left, two in the shotgun. Um, Gaskins to his right. And I'll treat this as Bills. zero. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, the yeah, dropping zero. safety back. Yeah, right. yeah at, at very late. Yeah, wow. yeah, po post snap, right? Mm -hmm. Um, gonna RPO to his gonna okay. get it out quick. Okay, underneath to the homie Jalen Waddle, and that's a good completion right there. That was a fearless throw, pressure right in his grill, right in his right grill. over, RPO, right over buddy. the top. Mm -hmm. Calls it with the single high. Got it Look out. Get that little hitch route. Boom. Gets it out. Good completion to Jalen Waddle. To a doing that thing that he do. Mm -hmm. Good block. Boom. Out. Good completion. Mm -hmm. First down, Miami. I'm actually shocked. Waddle. Waddle's not like, like way. Did you see what his separation more... was? The one thing you mm -hmm. haven't you guys noticed. Not a lot of guys are separating this game so far. Aren't you noticing that? Yeah, yeah. We, yo, we did not have good separation at all this game. And the next-gen stats even showed that. Yo, Waddle had like just around a yard and a half of separation. He's always consistently been between three or four yards. The route mm. combinations aren't giving you that, though, also. Yeah, so exactly. It, no, yeah. Yeah. Like, look at We're coming out of tr trips and – and, and, and you know, trips and bunches, and we're not getting guys in open space. It's so mm. frustrating, man. So, right now, we got um, 10 man personnel, Ahmed to the right of Tua. I'm sorry, to the left of T Tua. My bad. I apologize. Um, we got Trey Martin to the left, <laughs> one receiver split wide right, which is obviously Parker. Your little look at. Shifting back, look at that. And then again, yeah. RPO underneath, and they're gonna take Parker. And again, just another little. If you watch it, just like with Waddle, it's another little quick, little uh, hitch route. It's nothing over. Look at that, just boom, mm -hmm. gone. Hitch curl. It's the same thing, guys. Mm -hmm. So hitch route, and then boom, like it's just you know, and we don't get the first down. But again, it is the RPO. Boom. Out downfield. Just short of the first. So now we got a motion to the right side. Um, we got 11 man personnel, two receivers stacked to the right. Um, Gaseki out to the left. Tua in the shotgun. Ahmed to his right. Um, Bills showing that like cover four look again. Yep, quarters. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and then a fake on the handoff play action. Look at now it's to the other side. It's Gasicki on the hitch. Mm -hmm. Like very simplistic. Like they're just moving the looks to each side, right? That's all they're really doing. Yeah. Yeah. Get another RPO look. All right, mm. two by two alignment right here. Ten man personnel. Laird making rare appearances today in the back. Out to his right. That single high look, man. Mm -hmm. Obviously shown with the motion. And did you see mm -hmm. that? Did your boys see that? Uh, the blocking. Watch. Yeah, the blocking Watch. is. Uh... Gasek, you almost got hit. Ah, yeah. you see? Okay. yeah, you see it. You so, see how he had to move his body? Watch, guys. Everyone, that fumble that we have later on in the game. Okay, so mm -hmm. guys, this is the same drive. This mm -hmm. is the drive that leads to the fumble. So this is the, the fumble's coming up in a couple of plays. Watch, guys. Gaseki's gonna motion from the left side. Watch Gaseki try to avoid the snap. Whoop! Right? Almost so that, it. He's so, gonna leak out into the flats. There's a flag on the play. Tua. And it's it's the illegal shift by Gisicki yes, there. Yes. And then now they're gonna hit and we convert that first down with Laird. That, that that's so that I, I'm I'm gonna put this one on tour. 
that that's on tour because as as a quarterback, you're giving your right guard that signal that everything's okay. Give me the snap, right? But clearly, if Gasicki is designed to motion over there, you're not supposed to give that signal until Gasicki is past you. Mo- and, and and again, it looks like Tua may have missed that wrinkle in this play design to where Gasicki is motioning and he's he's asking for the snap a little bit too early. And w- which causes such uh, confusion in the backfield like that. So that that might be on tour for sure. And then he rolls out and he makes the throw. Mm-hmm. And then we know this converted and then it went bad after here. But again, here's another look at it. Kaseki avoiding. Look, at he shifted him. So I don't think he called for it, bro. He Hold didn't on, call for go, the snap. Get, go back, go back to the hand. Let me see. He shifted him. It, but look at Hunt. Hunt while he sh- watch Hunt's head while he waves. Okay, Hunt wait. Look at taps. Ah, uh, uh, well, Gasek is being moved okay. forward. That's on Robert Hunt. That's on Hunt. Yeah, that's clearly on Hunt. Hunt that's clearly on Hunt. Hunt's supposed to be tapping him when Gaseki motions out. Look at two is still IDing right now. Uh, so that is not on Tua Tungvaloa. That is on Robert Hunt. Now that see, this is this is the perfect view. And the later yes. one, yes. the later one is on Robert Hunt as well. Let, yeah, let, let's let's see it. Let's see. It. Okay, well, without that context, it looked like it was on tour. But yeah, yeah this is clearly now on Robert Hunt. It. It's on. It's yeah. on Robert Hunt. Yeah. Just missed. Oh, wow. Boy. And the thing that sucks is, look at we can. This was a huge conversion in the game. You guys remember? Yeah, I know. I remember we this. Yeah. This and it gets called back. Look at the offensive line. They can't block, and they're letting us down in those situations. So we'll obviously get to the fumble very soon. Um, ball game. Yeah, bro. Like coaching. Yeah. <laughs> I, man, I, hey, listen, bro, I'm speechless right now, man. Like, like that, is coaching. that is a direct result of coaching. If he was yes. properly coached up, Robert Hunt knows when to tap reader for the silent count. No? Right. Yeah, mm. sure. This is inexcusable shit when we're trying to drive against the number one defense in the NFL, gentlemen. Right. right. This is inexcusable. Absolutely. These mistakes should not be happening. I thought we were sold on defense and discipline. Mm. Yeah, that's bullshit. Mm. Anyways, 11-man personnel. Um, We have... Trey Wright, one receiver split out to the left, two in the gun. Um, we got that single high look. But they're trying to starting to creep back there, you see. Yeah, man Tua, three blitz. Yeah, Two up, mm-hmm. steps back, good pocket, and just ah. him and him and Hollins were on the same. He clearly thought Hollins was running a comebacker of some sort. Right. Whereas right. he ran more of a deep curl there, right? Right. So if you look at it, because he's throwing to the outside shoulder, that makes you think he's running a curl. It makes you think he thinks he's running that comeback. Mm-hmm. And it would have been there if he actually did run the comeback. Mm-hmm. Um, But incompletion by Tua, good pocket. And this is what that lack of a conversion has now started to lead to. So just a miscommunication there. By Rough, Matt man. Collins. Yeah, and then... Uh, Self-inflicted. Self-inflicted. And then we were out. I think we were out on that drive. So now we get the ball yeah. back. Mm-hmm. Um, we get this, the ball this, back. Is, this is when Josh Allen had the intentional grounding on fourth down. Yeah. Yeah. And we just got the ball back. Yes. So, okay. Um... We are currently in eleven man personnel. Mm. Um, two to the left, one split wide right, two in the shotgun. Um, running back to his left, Martin. Cloud Covers, six look. Cloud six. Cloud look six. From the Bills. Mm. And you're gonna see um, running back leaks out, but Tua, he's gonna make that throw. Hell of a that's, catch by Shaheen. Yeah, that is a hell of a catch, and that's a ballsy throw too. Mm-hmm, the coverage mm-hmm. is good on Shaheen mm-hmm. right there. Um, and we take a look at it one more time. You see Shaheen on that quick out route, and look at that ball game. What is yeah, that? Bro. What is that corner looking like? He's trying to do undercut the undercut route, right? The route. Yep. And 
to it still makes the throw, puts it where Shaheen can only catch the football. Mm-hmm. That's a big boy throw to an extent, guys. It was. Mm-hmm. I mean, that is a – you got to have zip to make that throw. Timing, accuracy, yeah. precision. Mm-hmm. I love Matt Milano, even though he's a bill. It hurts me. <laughs> That's right a hell there. of a throw. Yeah. yeah, that's a hell of a throw and a hell of a catch by Shane. Mm-hmm. Good play mm-hmm. there. All right. Y'all ready? Uh, shoot. <laughs> All right. So the Dolphins now, um, 11-man personnel, two in the shotgun. Gaskin to his right, one receiver split wide right, two to the left, including Gesicki in the slot. Tua. This is Quarters. a good one. Yep. And then just over the middle on that quick slant, Gasicki wide open. Easy, easy, easy completion. Right I'm, read, right I was, throw. I was so excited to see Tua just make that throw right there when there was clearly zero blitz. Yeah. Quarters, man on, right read, right throw. Perfect Hot timing. Read. Hot read, right? Yes. So good, 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 good play by Tua. Now, I believe this is the one, ladies, ladies and gentlemen. 11-man personnel, two splits to the left, including Gasecki in the slot again. One, Parker split wide right, two in the gun. Um, Auk, Gaskin to his right, Gaskin to see IDing. And again, they're going to show that blitz. Mm-hmm. Oh, this isn't the one. It's the next one. And he's going to take Waddle on that slant. Tredavis I thought that right. was P.I. So did I, but was it five yards off? Regardless, once the ball is in the air and That's the defensive like player makes contact, okay. yeah. that that has to, that has to be called on 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 spot, yeah. uh, like like spot foul, you know, pass yeah. interference. But they didn't call it. Yeah, he just like cut off his route. He didn't mm-hmm. even. He just played the body. He didn't even play the ball. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Look at each. That, that. Yeah. I don't know. That's a close one. So incompletion that, right there by Tre'Davious White. What were you going to say? Go ahead. Called. No, I'm, I'm saying that that just should have been play. called. That but look at it again, called. he made the hot read. Mm-hmm. Um, okay, so now here we go. Here comes the chaos. So Waddle bro. motioning to the right. Um, we are currently in 10-man personnel, two by two alignment receiver-wise, two in the gun. Um, you got Gaskin to his right. Yasiki now is gonna motion, and here is the snap. It hits him, it's a fumble. And just a circus are left man. on the board mm. once more by the Miami Dolphins. A complete. Didn't we have a missed circus. field goal earlier too? Right. We did. Yeah. Yeah. Again, what's new? Right. At so the very at, least, nine to Dickie, nine to three. Mm. The, like yelling at people to line up properly. To a again. What? Uh, why, is, why is the timing so bad, bro? Because look at watch Hunt's head. I Hunt told looks you, they, they ain't look, doing shit in practice, yeah. man. Hunt, Hunt now, instead of tapping him, look at. Do you see that? He gave him a signal. Mm-hmm. See? Instead of tapping, now they give a signal. Watch, guys. Watch Hunt's left arm. Now they're going for a signal. Right there. That's your signal. That it's little like the, did in the air, that's your signal. And it's like they're because, destined because to they fail. Didn't, they didn't want to give the same signal on the silent count because then they know, right? They can time it. So now they give that chop in the air, and there you go. There's your fumble. That is bad, guys. And Flores is just on the sideline like, are you kidding me? <laughs> Yet he don't fire are no you, one. You go figure are it out, you bro. kidding me? Man, that that's and, – and, and again, Watch, reason... right chop, see? And his head goes down, ball snap. That's what the signal was. <sighs> Missed opportunities, missed points. Painful, bro. At least nine to three, potentially thirteen to three going into the halftime. The Dolphins are not good, man. Nope. They're, they're not good. All right, two in the gun. Third quarter. Um, yep. You got uh eleven man personnel. Gaskin goes to the left side of Tua. Gesicki pissed off. He's gonna gate a flag right here. So that completion is for naught because Gesicki gains the flag. You saw what mm-hmm. he's doing. I think they called him for a false start, right? <laughs> like, do we still not have it right? <laughs> yeah. 
and Gesicki is not a happy camper. So I mean, clearly. Hey, you guys remember mm-hmm. I told you, you know, I asked Nick Kicks, I said, what's your biggest worry about heading into um, you know, this season? And, you know, is it the offensive line? He said, No, it's the playbook and the offensive coordinators. And I said, Why? And he told me directly, some of the receivers are having problems with the playbook. Wow. And now you're seeing some of them having problems with the playbook. And hmm. Gesicki is ordering them around. Not good, man. Like know. this should not be happening. This halfway through the season, that's inexcusable. Right, ten man personnel, like if, if that doesn't scream coaching, what the hell does? Stop blaming Tua. Ten man mm. personnel, two by two alignment with the receivers, two in the shotgun, Laird to his left. Um, you got the Bills in the cover two. Too high. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man. Roll to one. And mm-hmm. Tua is going to drop back. He's mm-hmm. going to survey. He's going to roll out. And that's because the pressure that was coming on that right side. And he's going to fall just short of the first down. And if you watch here, watch Robert Hunt and watch um, Jesse Davis. And you see Laird pulling to that side. Still not enough to help. It starts mm-hmm. collapsing. You see, Davis has lost his block now. To Russo, everything is covered Russo well. In the middle, yep. And Tua just rolls out against the yeah. grain, right? He did what he could. Yeah. yeah, and he he scrambled for a short, for a almost first down. All right, in the shotgun once more. Eleven man, two personnel, two receivers stacked to the left. Tua in the shotgun. Um. You got one receiver split wide right. Gaskin's going to motion to the right side again. Roll they're, down blitz. They're rolling down that blitz. Yep. Mm-hmm. And um, Tua motioned the uh, running back to that side mm-hmm. for a check down. So that became his hot read of sorts. Ugh. And he took it, but Milano was all over it from the jump. But here's the thing look at Parker. Yeah. Right, right off his ear. Yeah, Parker right was the ear. throw. Parker was the throw I would be making here. Mm-hmm. Um, but I know what he motioned. You know, he motioned over that side because of the blitz coming, and I understand why he took it. But to me, Parker's the the throw here. Yeah, on that slant. But yes. look at what they were doing. Again, they have a corner just sitting on top of the slant. Play off Parker and they just sit on top of what, the slant. It's the simplest shit, bro. They already knew what would come. See, that's what they're doing. And then, like, they're already knowing how they, they're just sitting on top of the slant. So you're not going to kill them after the catch. Yeah, they know the Dolphins' offense pretty much yeah. now. Yeah, they got us figured out. Everybody in the league does. Blown. That, Blown that, up. I know, bro. That, that, Look that it looks so out. bad live, bro. I was like, ugh. Diggs <laughs> wilding out over there. Good God <laughs> almighty. Um, Ugly, 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 ugly. All right, 12-man personnel, um, two in the shotgun. Ahmed to his right, two receivers split out wide left. And Tua is going to take the snap here. And, again, he's going to have the flat look. He's going to look it off. you got Eichenberg getting destroyed on the ground. So Tua tries to get rid of it. Hmm. Like Eichenberg again, absolutely destroyed. And I mean, what do we say at this point right now? Look at this Addison again over top. Just like just better, man, in every aspect. And then look at Tua, just get rid of it, get it out. Unreal, man. I know. It's, it's, what people it's, expect it's, this kid to be able to do with that type where, of question. Is here's my thing. thing. Where the hell can you even step up? Nowhere. You can step mm. up there, but it's too late. And Star Latula is waiting yeah, for him. Is, is waiting for you. Yeah. Yeah. Unreal. Like, I, don't, I don't know, man. It's... And it's with four against five. Yeah. Is this Probably. sabotage? Can, can, it, can, can, we, can we call this sabotage? A ve- very young and experienced offensive line, rookie offensive line coach, and you expect Tua to just take over. Like, look at Reader. Look at how quickly um, 
star gets off reader <laughs> like unre- and reader's been around the league you know what i mean like i know he, he's not a scrub really all right but hang around this office line enough you become you will one. become one mm-hmm. yeah you are the um, company you keep yeah really, exactly yeah. so we got Ahmed motioning out of the backfield empty set right now um and he splits out wide and again they show that look but it gets picked up by Gesicki, but he doesn't do a very good job. <laughs> but two is able to get it out, and he it's an incomplete pass towards Waddle. Mm-hmm. Um, but, I mean, he obviously felt that pressure coming. Um, again, you're going to see Gesicki now has to pick up, and he does a good job picking up the blitzer, but, I mean, not much. And then that, that comeback route towards that sideline, incomplete. Yeah, not, nothing was open, really. Yeah, that was his only choice. Downfield. And, mm-hmm. again, you see Gasicki's effort here. And it all starts with how – with how, look at his footwork at the beginning of the snap, guys. Like, what are you doing? Did you see that footwork at the beginning of the snap? Watch his feet at the beginning of the snap. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Now, why do you think – like, the guy's going downhill. He's going to have you on that. Yeah, I know, Where did you man. think he was going? Inside on you? What, you thought he was going to stunt on you or something? Like, like he, was, he was startled. <laughs> Look at this. His toes right. are pointing towards each other, bro. What's going on here? Look at that. Is he taking a shit or is he trying to block? Bro, oh, bro, it, it, it looked look like in his mind he said, Jesus. <laughs> this poor preparation. Oh, I got this up. <laughs> Go ahead. Jesus oh, Christ. Yeah. Piss poor preparation leads to piss poor performance. Mm-hmm. It leads to us going three and out. Yeah. Mm. Um, all right. Tua under center. We haven't said mm. that much very much today, right? Pleasant uh, surprise. Mm. 12 man personnel. Um, you have single back formation, which is Ahmed. Um, two receivers tight. Gasicki to the right. Um, waddle to the left side there. Um, and again, that cover four look to a, he's going to fake the handoff and then he's going to just take Ahmed underneath and Ahmed fights and fights and gets near the sticks. Um, I love Ahmed, man. Yeah, I do, man. He's, he's like the little engine that could, you know, I, mean? I know, I know, man. So again, see this. Again, good coverage downfield, boys. Right. Mm-hmm. Right read, right gotta, throw. Yeah, you got to take that read. You got to take that throw. Mm-hmm. Take what the defense gives you, which is what Josh Allen started doing against us. In a right? major way. Yeah, in a major way. He's just taking what they gave mm-hmm. him. Mm-hmm. Um, and so, yeah, just an easy little completion underneath into the flats by Tua to Ahmed near for the first down. Um, all right. Now, empty set, two to the left. Three split to the right to a single high uh, man look from the Bills to a in the shotgun. Um, That's a nasty man free. You see how you see how that pocket is, you know, Jeff Davis is just getting killed. So frustrating. Mm -hmm. And then back shoulder throw from Tua to Waddle. Ball's incomplete, but Tua had to get it out probably before he wanted to because he threw more of a comeback. Waddle ran more of a curl. Oh, that was Gaskin. Yeah, yeah. Oh, sorry, I remember Gaskin, this. my bad. Yeah. It was Gaskin. He I ran more of a this. curl and mm-hmm. Tua threw a comeback. It was, again, like Matt Collins earlier, right? Yeah, man. And he hit him in the hands. That was the only throw to make as because far as the Because his body he had to – Shift mm-hmm. so much you couldn't make the you know Gaskin isn't a wide receiver. I'm not gonna nah, you know, but he he does have very good hands for, for a running back though. So you know, um, diff, difficult catch to make, but I mean, yeah, give him an opportunity, give him a chance. I that's a, di- that's a difficult catch. Yeah, that's a yeah. difficult catch to make. He completely had to uh, flip his it was body. Like, it was weird. He's like he fade. He like, came through like a fade. But then mm-hmm. it was like with a curl at the top, and but instead two or three like a comeback. They're clearly just better. They're three years ahead of us, and clearly better. Mm-hmm. Look and at right. look, look at Davis. 
go go watch, go back to the Jesse beginning. Davis. Yeah. Watch Jesse Davis on the snap. How can a guy? Well, Look at I silent guess. count again. Do you see him? Patted mm-hmm. him. Yeah. Silent count again. They got it right. Good for them. Look at this. Look at Davis right now. I guess I understand yeah. it, but I don't understand it. How you can be the most experienced guy on the on the offensive line and the worst, but be the worst. <laughs> hey man, I'm gonna blame him for some of Hunt's regression. Yeah. Mm. Um. Yeah. All right, eleven man personnel, two to the right, one out wide to the left, two in the shotgun. Um, he's got running back to his right, and he's going to fake the handoff, and you see leaking into the flats, but he's gonna go deep. I like that shot. The, the sh- yeah, I knew you would too. Hey, for mm-hmm. I take it, but here's the problem though: you're at a position now where you're trying to take these shots, and they're all over this stuff. Uh, like, it, uh, like you haven't, you haven't at any point done. You haven't yeah. done. It, was, it wasn't a good throw. Like that part, I, I, I agree. Yeah, mm-hmm. like this but was you, this was behind Waddle. You got a lead Waddle here. You got Waddle running that that like that post, mm-hmm. and you look at that and. Waddle had to hold up at the top yes. of the post, right? And that's because yeah. of the throw. That what, wasn't what actually you, a good throw by two. What do they do to set up any of that? Nothing. Yes, that's I the problem. I agree with you, 110%. So they're sitting on, they're able to sit on everything. Not even remotely surprised because the route combinations too. Look at you got, hold up. So you got Gaskins leaking out. You got the tight end going to the flat. You got, who is that Here, coming I'll bring across? It for you. I'll bring it for you. I'll give you a high look so you can see everyone leaking. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So you got I Gaskin. I think you're going to have Shaheen leaking out from the Shaheen left. Le- okay, uh, he so Shaheen's blocking and, and he... leaking. Yeah. You got the crosser coming over, and you got the tight end, whoever this is down here on, on top of the 30, widening out his guy. But then you're going to – Yeah, and then, it's, then it's Waddle. He's running it. that post. Yeah. The, the Waddle throw or the underneath flat throw to Shane are your only open. That's it. Here. Yeah. Yeah, everything and else is covered those, well. And both mm-hmm. of those, man, it's just, it's, uh, and this is just a bad throw. It was like, like that's all that. I, I I I like the shot, didn't like the throw. Exactly, like the yeah, shot, exactly. didn't like the throw. Yeah. And he, even when he was setting up into the pocket right here, you can clearly see like his feet were a little bit off. Yeah, you know oh, what his I mean? feet was like, terrible. Look at his face right there, yeah. bro. And he yeah. had a chance to reset because if you look at yeah. it, he resets. He's starting to reset, and then he just goes away from it. And yeah. that's why it hung up on him because he didn't yeah. plant his feet. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like this is not a good back. You know, you don't want to be throwing that deep off your back foot with to his arms. You don't have a rocket. You know what I mean? This is all upper body he's using here. Yeah. You know what I mean? And so, and, 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 and it's, with it's, the way he threw it, if you actually watch his motion, mm-hmm. it's to his open side. But the way he's motioning, he comes across his body. Look, see. Yeah, comes across his body. Yo, hold on a sec. Watch his head. Was he looking at Shaheen when he made that throw? Yeah, it looked like a little no, no look. Oh right yeah, there. it was a no yeah, look. No look. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah, and they didn't fall for it. But but it's it's equally as frustrating because I know Tua wants to trust his offensive line so he can reset right there and make a better yeah. throw. But he just wants to get but rid of it. It's it's just been so leaky the entire game. He's like, you know what? Let me just. Get it. Let, out. let me just get Man, this out of here. I'm not taking no extra punishment. So yeah. Yeah, let me get this shit out. Let me get mm-hmm. it out. All right. Mm-hmm. Um, so 10 man personnel, two in the gun. Gaskin to his left, two by two receiver alignment. You see right there, they're switching up their look pre snap. Look at that. Drop really it back. good. That's well coached. Yep. That's well coached. And then everything is just covered Blanketed. and isolated. Yeah, that's two under that mm-hmm. underneath route. And DVP happens to make a man miss. They gonna give you that though because they no threat. Yeah, mm. you ain't you ain't taking that to the house. Yeah, you can rally right. up. They can tackle. Just mm. that hitch again. The mm-hmm. hitch falls out on point. Guy over pursues the route. Tredavious White over pursued. Thought he could get underneath it. Parkerton. That's why Tredavious White's mad there because he thought he could <laughs> undercut it. And then, um, I mean, it is a good throw by Tua. Yeah, it is. So you get the first down, but I mean, you're not threatening the top of a defense with a hitch route. That's for sure. Mm -hmm. Um, All right. So 11 man personnel, two in the gun, two receivers split wide right, Gaseki split wide left. Um, Running back to two is right. Um, 
You see that? Look at that. Again, the motion, right? Yep. Bring down the safety, roll blitz. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then he tries to hit. And I think Iseki should have got a flag. Tredavious White got away with so many him. PIs this he game. He mugged him on this slant here. Incredible. Watch. Look at him. Are you raped. kidding me? Raped. And we've been calling. Yo, Gusecki's not been getting the calls a lot this year. None. Have you noticed uh, that? None. What, what does he say to referees to make them not want to give him like. Well, look at We're going to like here. obvious pass interference call. Gonna fake. Look at. You got Tremaine Edmonds jumping up to try and take that lane away. Mm -hmm. Two would just wait him Second out. Second window. Pressure in yep. his face. Second window. Pressure in his face. And look at that. And That's incredible. This guy's on his caught back, him. bro. Look at this. He's on his back. That's incredible. They did, they did not call that. This is a pass oh. interference all day. Home field advantage. I... I... I mean, can we just play football, this. bro? Like, Look damn. <laughs> That's incredible, bro. <laughs> he literally Donkey Kong, like, <laughs> like jumped on his back. <laughs> no <Kong>. flags. <laughs> it's weird, man. I don't know. Kasiki gets no no love, bro. We're no not calls, get those no calls, man. The problem is we're not going to get those calls because nobody respects them. Until I they, agree. Until they go out and prove to consistently you know, make plays, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I I agree. I agree. That that's more like a message than anything else. I ain't giving you shit. Make a place, huh? You know. You know what's but, crazy though, as we're watching this, the only guys on this offense that showed up are Parker, Tua, Waddle, and Gasecki. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I'm including the offensive line when I say that, ladies and gentlemen. So, mm -hmm. um, well, I mean, I guess Jackson did, I guess. <laughs> so, two in the I shotgun. Suppose. Um, Gaskin to his left. Um, ten man personnel, two split left, two split white, two by two alignment, cover two shown. But they're gonna drop back. You're seeing now, they drop back. All out, bitch. Yeah, into that, and they go that single high look now, man. And what can Tua do? Nothing. It's what rough, can Tua man. do? Let's watch the God view and see. And Davis is pointing at someone at the sideline. I don't know what. Maybe he thought that Tua needed another stretcher because of him. I don't know. <laughs> but look at this. Look at that early. The, ooh. That's a ooh. great get off by that. Uh, I was going to say, was that early? Look, look at it. Look was at that it. Hughes? That was Hughes, right? Let's see. Hughes hmm. in between. Um, you know, what is he, seven tech right now? Yeah, yeah, he's way out there. Yeah, so mm -hmm. he's seven tech right now, and he, oh, he looked he like got he got early. up before everyone, bro. That's early. That was early. Look yeah, at it, early. watch it again. No one's up except Hughes, like on either side. No one's Let, even let's moving. See. Let's see the snap. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, he was early. Yeah, yeah, and then he comes he around, early. widens out. Tua tries to get through, but here's the other thing, boys. Jeez. He's not even the one who made right. the tackle, ladies and gentlemen. Look who makes the tackle. Mr. Oliver. Good old Ed Oliver, who we remember, boys. Solomon Kinley dominated last year when he faced him, okay? Yeah, dominated him when I did my film study. Look at What are you doing, Jesse? Sorry, Austin. What are you doing, Austin? How does Austin not get charged with this sack? What is PFF watching with no pressures? Look at the feet right now of Austin Jackson. What is this guy doing a dance? He's so, trying to block two people at once. <laughs> but he recovers. It's, it's, but then yeah. but then the spin-off. I don't know how that sack can, is not charged can, off of Jackson. Can, can you rewind back to the field view? Let, let me see the routes, route combinations one last time to see if he if Tua had any hope to like even throw it out to anybody. No. No. Oh, no, no okay, that, that was, yeah, that was good shit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is it. This is it. Mm -hmm. Look, he even looked early there, ball game. Yeah, he, he was early. He looked mad early there. Watch how early he looks up on, on the left side here. Look. Yeah, yeah, he was yeah, offside. He was offside. Yeah, for sure, and they didn't mm -hmm. call it. They ain't call a lot of stuff, bro. But nah, no, not, not, nothing was open. Yeah, nothing was open. 
and he didn't have any room to maneuver and make a throw. Okay, it, 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 it did it like Jesse was looking for a stretch. Look at like, now hey, we're man. catching penalties. Look at look perfect. I got it. Look at that screenshot. No one's moving except Hughes. Look, he's already getting off. He's off sides. Yeah. But what, what, what's 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 that penalty call? Because there's like three offside type Is that of penalties. That's encroachment ball game. That's encroachment. Mm, unevaded to the quarterback. Um. Yeah, encroachment. Ouch. Ah. Oh. And then they're celebrating, living, loving life, when really that place shouldn't even have happened. Mm. All right. So now. We got an empty set with Gaskin motioning out of the backfield to the right side. Mm -hmm. um, now, they still are in. I mean, you could count this as 10-man personnel because of how Smythe is lined up on the left side of the offensive line. Mm -hmm. um, anyways, Gaskin's going to motion out. It's an empty set. Tua, he's going to take the snap. And you see the good protection there. He had a lot of room to step up. He's going to try, and and he does make that throw to Jalen Waddle, and that is a first down. That is a first down, first but down. that's also a that's also a uh, right at the top, right there. As soon as he turns around on that comeback, that's a mm -hmm. tough throw when you got to throw towards the outside, and the corner takes the outside. The, the the defender takes the outside and the receiver too. Yeah, that's got to be like really good ball placement. Exactly. Or you're yeah. gonna you're gonna put the defender right there, creeping on the outside of the fifty in a in a spot to make a play, because that's where how Waddle opened up. But mm -hmm. look at what Waddle did. did he came back that? to the football. Yeah. yeah, but did you notice how he kind of he, he kind of took an extra step at the top of his route. Like, look, Trying he to... stops there at the fifty-one, at the forty-nine, right? Mm -hmm, but then mm -hmm. he he goes up to about like the fifty-two and a half, and he catches the football. Good catch yeah, just just to, just to body Good out the, the defender. Yeah, yeah. but catch. but that, that it can also assist Tua to get it out a little earlier. You know, Good, as far as pocket. anticipation, that's mm -hmm. a good pocket right there. But hell, hell of a throw, hell of you know, hell of a time to get it out of his hand right there. Third uh, down. I do, I don't I do want to ask you guys though. Mm -hmm. What about Kaseki here on this on this on this mm -hmm. route? Let's see. But see, look at how the congested mm. again it's, it's, two, he, the routes on two routes, routes yeah. on top of each other, right? Yeah, yeah. The bet the better throw is Waddle, just just yeah. because of how clean it yeah. is. Yeah. And and you know, but third again, down those congested areas, bro. Yeah. yeah. Con concepts and designs not that good. Yeah, now nah, that that was a throw. Yeah, it was right. It was right. Read right throw. All right. Um, we got two in the shotgun. Um, I believe that's Gaskin to his right. Actually, mm -hmm. it might be Ahmed. I think it's Ahmed. We got Trey left Martin. One receiver. That, 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 that's that's true. Right? <laughs> uh, with Gaseki. Because Gaseki's in the slot. Mm. Um 10 man personnel. Again, silent count. You just saw Hunt Tap Reader. Mm -hmm. And they're gonna take the shotgun, step back, and he's just gonna take that little underneath, that quick little hitch right mm. there. You see it. Let's see what else. Because he saw. The okay. middle vacate with the running back being yeah. picked up by the linebacker. Yeah. But here's the thing: I'm taking the the, the drag route. Yeah. Yeah. Because I'm taking the drag the, route. The two routes to that side cleared the space for exactly. Him. Exactly. They did their job. They manufactured space there, but Tua didn't look to that side. He got the ball out. Mm -hmm. Now, when we flash and look to the protection again, look at Hunt. Hunt. Here's your. Boom. Yeah, I, I I I didn't I didn't like uh I, I didn't like Tua staring that one down right there. Yeah. He he could have stayed to the field side with the yeah. three receivers, watch it clear out and then hit that underneath, you know. Yeah. So because he had it. Yeah. Um empty set. Um three to the left, two to the right, two in the shotgun. 
single high look. Man. This why are they playing off? So you see that deep safety right there? Yeah. He's look like 30 that. yards away from the yeah. football, damn near. But look at the they just want to make they're just trying to make sure that if somebody in that instance he have room enough to actually see what's coming and get over the top of Pre- it. Prevent, yeah, Pre- pretty yeah, much. without having to because this guy out at the bottom was playing, yeah, hey, all playing off and they just rallying up. Mm. So right here he's gonna take the um bottom left route. Um on white man free you got Ahmed on that like dig that short dig and white all over um, it Mr. Davis I'm, white all over I'm, since 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 i see that that safety 30 yards off the ball mm. and i know i got man coverage i'm working that bottom right right there or the sorry the, the top top right the top that one the, on one matchup at the yeah yeah I, I either i'm throwing it high right now or i'm throwing it right to that out route right now Especially with that matchup with Gasicki, I, I, I like that one. Boom, get yeah, it to the, him. Uh, yeah, because he gets the sticks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I agree. Give him a chance, man. It's always yeah. about that. Thirty yards off the ball. Look at look at Micah High. Damn. Yeah, he's so far deep back. Yeah, man. Work 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 your work your one on ones underneath, bro. Do it. That's it. Again, look at what they're doing. Two in the shotgun, layered to his left. Look at that stack to the bottom left of your screen. That's an interesting formation. Um, and then you got a receiver in the slot to the left side, and then one split out wide right. Mm-hmm. Um, and I would have actually would have liked to see them run out of that instead of motion. Kasiki out of the stack. Yeah. Um, and then you see good coverage downfield. Really good coverage. Yeah. Tua is going to try and force that. Mm-hmm. To the sideline to Parker, and it's just sat on. There's nothing there for him at all. Um, you look at the coverage again. That's why I would have liked to run it out of that stack. You might have created something, but I mean, that comeback is coverage. I mean, it's locked down. What are you going to do there? Nothing. Mm-hmm. You're not, yeah, you're not getting free on that. No. Nah. So. And that um, that 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 guy got right in there, bro. That blitz, uh, yeah, Milano. Right yeah. Mm-hmm. Now look, look, look oh, at Milano, Milano right in the middle. In the middle. Yeah. Yeah. Right, right there. Three. Laird could look at Laird. <laughs> Laird got away with a hold, but he kind of blew him up early though. He's like, man, get up, get up out the club. Like, <laughs> gave him a form. <laughs> All right. Um, you got again ten man personnel, two in the shotgun. Mm-hmm. Um, Laird to his left. Man, Waddle's free. gonna motion into the slot. Yep, single high again. Two is hey, gonna man. step back. He's got room to step up. He did. He's gonna yes. Do it. And look at the throw. All Boom. day, Boom. baby. Mike. This is, is what happens when he steps when he steps up into the pocket, man. Things oh, just no, when he has time to step up. step up or or land yeah. to step up and do. Yeah. yeah, but 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 there have been times where he could have. But I'm just glad he did it this time officially. Especially on fourth down, we needed to play. Look at how Gisicki rounds out his post. That's hilarious. And then (laughs) just right across. Like, look at, watch this post. I want you to, this is a post route. Watch this post route by Gisicki. Mm -hmm. That's why the defender just rides him the whole time. Ready? We'll just take the inside on the post. that ain't no post. That ain't no post. (laughs) (laughs) Brutal. That's a a banana route, bro. I don't know what that is, bro. (laughs) Oh, retarded corner. <laughs> That's his attempt at a post, bro. Come a on. Crosser. He got oh, a deep crosser. Well, no, the reason the I'm saying I have to post his watch, he's stemming it, right? He stems it like a go, and then he starts breaking. Yeah, yeah. He, he bent into the DBs yeah. to, to. So there you to go. That, that, and um... just like, look at the timing. Perfect right in between the coverage, the whole shot right there. Mm-hmm. Good throw by Tua. Boom. Yeah. Good play by Tua. Good play Damn, so, by uh, mm-hmm. Love it. Again, look Man. at they like Laird making, you know, clear. They, they, they got it. They got to give Tua this pocket more consistently, bro. Let the him step in. Helmets are being lost. Oh, man, coming out. Jesse Davis thinks he's the man. Tua just steps up. Resets that good, good lob. 
Yes. That is good better line. footwork right on the money. Mm-hmm. Woo! <laughs> All right. So here we go. Um, we got the Dolphins right now. Pistol motioning Waddle to the right side. 11 man personnel. Smythe rolling out. Two was going to take it himself and try to run it, and he gets stopped up. Now, when you look at the God view, Jesse Davis, why aren't you bleed blocking for your running back? Watch this. Jesse Davis, okay. Right? Two is going to roll out. What are you doing, Jesse? Spectate. What are you mm. doing? You got one man in front of you. This should be a touchdown run. Yeah, blow him up right there. You can there. clean that man out. Mm -hmm. But what are you doing? I'd rather be a spectator. <laughs> Lack of awareness, bro. It's unbelievable. Should Jesse, should Jesse Davis be on the roster next year, man? Fuck no. No. Uh, all right. Yeah. I agree. Single back formation. Oh, my going to say, yeah. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> 12 man personnel. Jesse Davis. <laughs> He's and good, guys. Look at the push right here from Gaskin yeah, on Gaskin's, two to get in. Yeah. I felt like mm. I was like, damn, he's going to break his back. Yeah, I know. Eh? I'm like, yo, it's my quarterback. Be careful, guys. <laughs> so there you go. Look at two is not getting it. Gaskin comes in and clears it out. Appreciate that. Yeah. Needed that. Look at sick. You're getting high. Let's go. All right. Here we go. Two point conversion. 10 man personnel. Yep. Two man con point, two point conversion. Two in the shotgun. Gaskin to his left. Shane on the boundary. He's going to motion inside. To make it more of an eleven man personnel look to a RPO wide open, wide open in Beautiful. the back of the end zone. Beautiful design right there. Gotta love it. <laughs> Bills fans, crazy. Look at the RPO, and then boom, over the top, right in the right in the hands. Beautiful stuff. So man. at that at that point, it was seventeen to eleven. Yes, now it's mm. 17 to 11. All that nonsense, and we were still down by six points? Yeah. Lord. So now, two in the gun, Laird to his left, two by two alignment, 10-man um, personnel. Um, you got them rolling back into cover four. Tua, he gets a decent pocket. He's going to move up when the trouble starts. And then he's going to kick it out. Smart play by Tua to kick Hell it out to play. Laird there. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, you look at this once more. Let's go back and see what the coverage was downfield. Um, it's good coverage downfield, boys. Mm -hmm. yeah. So he steps out, makes the play, a lot of space mm -hmm. in front of Laird. Give it to him. Mm -hmm. Give it to him, get to the sticks. Mm-hmm. Good play by Tua. Heads up awareness. Nothing downfield. Take what they give you, man. Boom. Mm. Head, always, head was on a swivel that drive. Yep. Or that yep. play, my bad. Yep. Good play by Tua. All right. Now we got 10 Great minute personnel instance. again. Layer to the left. Um, Shaheen split left. Um, Trey right. Um, they're going to drop back into cover two, deep cover two. Two man, yep. Yeah, and two, uh, again, you see the coverage is pretty good. Mm -hmm. Coverage is good. Now, it's coming up over the middle, and two, uh, big ah, drop by Parker. Parker. He dropped big it. Drop. Yeah. And this is going to eventually lead to an interception, right? Wow. Because this is for the first okay. down. See, you got, look at, nice play off the line by Parker to get a clean release. Then look at, he's got him chasing him on the dig the whole way. You got to finish. The you got to finish man. that play though, man. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Watch uh, guys, watch his release. Watch his feet at the release. Fantastic footwork by Parker on the release. Just to have the corner chasing. Look at watch. Whoop! Mm. Look at that. He's chasing the whole way. Yeah. Good read, right read, right throw. Receiver did not come through. That one hurts. Ball hit him in the right space. Yeah, because you're moving the chains right now. Oh, wow. He left, hand, he left his hands on the sideline. And he had been Ugh. so good all game. I know. And have a brain fart when we, because this was, when we needed this it, was 17 11 still, right? 
I, I think I think I think this one was when it was twenty to yeah, um, twenty to 11. eleven. They added mm-hmm. three. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. They added three. So you score here, you're right back in it. We need uh, that, man. Off. Ten man personnel, Trey Wright. Um again, Shaheen to the left. It's a very similar look. Laird to the left, two in the shotgun. Tua gonna take the snap and he's gonna clear out. And he's going to throw to the right sideline because the pressure was in his face. If you watch mm. Jesse Davis here, Jesse Davis, and it's another silent count. Look at the bull rush on Davis by Hughes. Wow. Did you see how quickly he was pushed back? The, our, our offensive tackles are weak. Watch like, this. Yeah, weak. no functional strength whatsoever, bro. Watch this. Look at And he got an early – and he was all false start. And mm. he got away with it. Watch. This is a false start. Ready? False start. Yeah, it was. Mm. And he got away with it. And you still got bull rushed. And you squared the man up. And he got called for it, I think. They call, did call and flag him for the false start. Functionally weak, man. So you got a false Both start tackles. and you got beat like that. Unreal. Mm. Um, Again, that same look. We've now seen three plays in a row. Mm-hmm. Same personnel. Trey Wright, Shaheen to the left. Two in the gun. Laird to his left. Sorry, it's Parker. My bad. That's no, it's Shane. I apologize. I'm right. Man. And again, now fumble. Damn. Now a fumble. I didn't even see that play, bro. Because you keep giving them the same look. Look at Eichenberg, bro. Look at this. Oh, he was just Trip. around him, around him, and straight. That, that was that kung fu Joe chop, man. <laughs> <laughs> right around Eichenberg. Eichenberg is a disaster, my friend. He's very bad. Yeah, he's very bad. But again, it's difficult to grade any of like these with one linemen. arm. He used one arm to hold him off, and then he used his other arm to swipe. Watch right. this. He uses his left arm to hold Eichenberg off, and then Hughes is going to use his right arm to get Eichenberg's left hand off of him. Watch. Mm -hmm. He holds him off with the left arm right there. Now watch his right arm. He's just going to move it out of the way. the way. Yep. Done. Fumble. Eichenberg's trash. Hunt falls on it. Thank God we come away with the football. Wouldn't matter in the long run. But now you've had a drop. You've now had bad protection that leads to a fumble. Again, we go with that same look. Trey right, Shaheen to the left, Laird to his left in the shotgun, 10-man personnel. Again, the same look. Fourth play in a row, they've gone with the same play design. And now, because he feels forced, because look at how far the sticks are away. I know. He puts I know. it over the middle. You Take got shot. Waddle you got, right here. But you got two players in the same area. Yeah. Yeah, again. Again, mm-hmm. nothing spaced at, out. I'm, mm-hmm. I'm just taking the safe throw here underneath at the 20 to Laird, but and make it a fourth down. Yeah, 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 but he feels forced to make a play here because of the score undercut by the safety. And there you go. Game over. Mm-hmm. Almost a pick six and game over, basically. But again, you got with the same play design now, four plays in a row. It hasn't worked for you at mm. all. And now you're going to go back to it. And look at the coverage is all good. Now, he has them coming up, but they're just, you have three men sitting on the top of that route he's throwing to. Yeah. And it just gets undercut. And. But again, he, even, even being in this situation, bro, that's like, it's tough. We it's shouldn't tough be tour. because Devontae Parker should have had that completely. Had yeah. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Exactly. Just, just shooting ourselves in the foot, you know, as usual. Ugly. You know what I mean? Just ugly, man. This is shit young cats, young teams do. Yeah, we can't afford to do this shit, though. That's the thing. Yeah. Good protection. Decent. Yeah. Man. That ball just sailed on him, too. Yeah, it did. It Look did. at his face when he threw the he, football. He, you he, he had, he, yeah, he had he no that, like, intention. like a baseball, dude. Exactly. There, there was no intent on that throw. It was just like, right, let me get the ball out of my hand. No intent. Yeah, look at how his body twist at the end. Mm-hmm. No yeah. intent. Yeah. He didn't drive through that properly mm-hmm. with the lower half of his body. Mm-hmm. Been a horrible position to be in yeah. anyway. So yeah. Thank you, Devontae Parker. So now <laughs> um empty set with Gaskin going out to the right side. This is 
Um, the last play of the game, guys, we got the ball back mm -hmm. after they went up by 15 and we decided let's run a screen and the screen goes absolutely nowhere. nowhere. I felt Jason Taylor after this play when he was, he was like, losing it on this play. Why? Yeah, why are you calling it? At this point of the game, it's game. the game is over. Just take why the knee and get the hell up out of there. It's like they're looking for a mistake. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so, guys, I mean, we look back at it. What? We only counted like two or three missed reads all game for Tua. Um, he took a lot of the right stuff. Be better game than I, than I than I than we originally thought, thought right? The, just yeah. the coverage was very good. And Hats the off to the Bills. We're very good, and the pass rush was consistently good against us. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Hats off to the Bills. Your mm -hmm. guys' thoughts on uh, your final thoughts on that whole all twenty-two session. That that's a solid B minus for me. You know, as far as well, what, what I've up seen. Grade for you, eh? Yeah, I yeah. Minus. I had a C minus going in after the broadcast. After right. It came out. I I given him a C plus. Yeah, I'm 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 giving I'm giving him a B minus. There was a lot more um, plays that I I assumed initially were negative by Tua, but obviously when you watch film, you know the context of certain things. You're like, wait a minute, nah, like he he was right. So, um, so, solid B minus for me. Um, there's still a lot of things that that we need to clear up. Not not from Tua's end, but offensively, philosophically. If if it's working, like you said already, Reese, if it's working, do not get away from it, especially against an opponent that you know is having issues stopping what you're what you're throwing out there. Script it, stay with the script, and then just you know, do do your wizardry, man. Take some stuff out, put some stuff in, and and, and let let's drive the football, let's score some points, man. Because let me tell you, uh, we didn't we didn't put any defensive plays up. But if we would have that defense, bro, they they went back to their old ways, man. Zero uh, uh, man blitz, exotic blitzes. Baker was out, so it was much more, you know, uh, uh, as far as effort. You, you can clearly see they were all playing for each other defensively. Um, but, again, offensively, man, we have to start looking like a pro offense, man. Let, let's do it, man. Let, let's stop playing. And let let's get these guys ready to really, you know, you know, go go at the jugglers out here, man. So um again, Tua Tuesdays, bro. That that was a solid B minus performance for me for Tua. There's still some things he needs to work on as far as trust and timing and, and just overall, you know, what what he can try to do, uh, especially with the lack of protection up front with the offensive line. But I mean, I, I couldn't ask for nothing more from Tua as far as what he had to deal with uh, defensively against the Buffalo Bills and then what he obviously had to deal with on a weekly basis. So uh, offensively. So, I mean, ain't nothing more I can ask for, man. That was, that was a good what, film session. What, 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 what did you think, uh, ball game? He got two guys, man, really out there trying along with him and Waddle and Gasicki. Aside from mm -hmm. that, I've never seen – I've never been – in all my years of coaching football and playing football, Three against eleven is always a disadvantage, and unfortunately, you know when when you look at where we are in terms of um, development and growth, we're hurting in the. I always say we're hurting in the key areas in which you can't really be um, competitive. You you have to have some sense of understanding in regards to why you're doing what you're doing, and then be able to execute it with some level of consistency and. Um, whether it's a lack of, um, I'd say, intensity in practice, or they're just not repping and stuff, or practices may be so soft that they're just not doing anything at all. But the, the product they're putting on the field on Sundays is clearly rep representative of the Are fact we the that worst team in the NFL right now? Hell yeah. Moment? Yeah, I, I think so. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I you like what, uh, don't know what they're doing. representative said there. Wish they would design more plays like that two point conversion in the regular offensive sets. I agree with mm. you. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. Um, ball game. Uh, yeah, Martin, I appreciate y'all as always. Looks like we'll be doing this for the rest of the season because two is our guy. Thank you. Good to see the development and the growth. Um, for the rest of the season now, at least he doesn't have that cloud hanging over him until at least March. Um, mm -hmm. 
man, it's going to be uh, interesting to watch the rest of the season unfold. Um, obviously, we got the game coming up this weekend against the Texans that I was supposed to be at. Um, mm. But, hey, it is what it is. Um, I will be back tomorrow, guys. I will be dropping the Jalen Phillips film study for all of you. Patreons and members, expect that to go up late night tonight for all of you guys. So, guys. And and, and, that, and now that it's like the final nine with Tua, mm-hmm. man, let, let, let's go out with a bang, Tua, man. Let's take some shots, bro. Let's do it, You got bro. nothing to lose, man. It ain't even Probably. him, though, bro. You got nothing to lose. No, no, no. I'm not, I'm not saying – I, all, all I'm saying is when even when it comes to Mike Gesicki and and you know there's certain things that are cloudy like as far as coverage and stuff, I still I still take him man. Like what 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 can, what do we have to lose man? Let's let's do it. Yeah. Let's Tell do it. Tell guys man. to dial up something more than double double drags. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I double wish, drags, man. hitches, table routes, and freaking yeah. dig routes, man. Yeah. Yeah, all I'm right, with boys. You. Um, yep. I'll be back tomorrow, guys. I'll, it's gonna it's gonna be recorded, but you guys will get it tomorrow. Jalen Phillips film study will be dropping on your heads tonight. If you're a member of Patreon, if you're a YouTube channel member or Patreon, that'll be coming out to you late night tonight. You'll have it in the morning. If you are a regular subscriber, that'll be coming out to you sometime tomorrow in the day. So look, be on the lookout for the Jalen Phillips film study, um, where we're gonna look at if he can be a difference maker in the NFL. All mm-hmm. right, guys. Um, I appreciate each and every one of you for coming out. Um, I hope you all enjoyed um, a Tuesday on a Wednesday this week. We'll be back to two uh, to Tuesdays next week. Um, so until, until you guys see me next, I'll be back live on Friday for the um, preview show um, for the game on Sunday. So until I see y'all Friday, but you'll be seeing me tomorrow. Fins up all day, every day. Stay happy, healthy, safe, and blessed. Smash that like button. Subscribe if you're new. And hit the notification bell to make sure you get notified whenever I go live or drop some new content for y'all. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Have a good evening, ladies and gentlemen.